Hey guys, Jan here from Walking the Faith Adventures. So I'm here with a fantastic couple. So Francis and Nelson, awesome couple. Um, so they're just going to share a little bit on why they like hiking today. So this is Nelson. <laughs> Good morning, guys. So we're just on a bit of a day hike today. And uh, just really enjoying nature and uh, enjoying our time together. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, how you guys going? All right. All good. Are you enjoying the hike? Yes. yes. Yeah, it's such yeah. a cool hike, eh? It's, um, you know, obviously it's, it's really cool to see you guys, and um, you know, very, very inspirational. You guys are together and things. So, um, what what started you guys in your hiking journey? We actually love hiking, but because we had uh, we started young, having a family, um, we did not have the chance to do it because no one was looking after the kids. Um, and now that the kids have grown up, and we're also thinking about our physical health, and so we we just got into it. <laughs> we're not sure if we could do it, but um, hey, here we are. We're doing it together. Cool. Yeah, just like what I said a while ago, I like running, but uh, she likes uh, walking, so might as well we do it together. Yeah. Plus, uh, well, well, after uh, uh, the whole week of working, mm -hmm. so we have to have a um, small, uh, short, um, yeah. short fitness. Mm -hmm. So we are really keen to to take this. Uh, Sports. Oh. Uh, yeah, um, been here for 16 years now. Um, came here first. Uh, I was just a tourist, and then uh, I took the the, vi uh, the opportunity of having the visa of uh, a seasonal work permit. So I took that one, and then when that visa ended up, I. I tried to apply for a student visa, and then it was really hard to, to have that, you know. Um, it was too hard to, to apply for that student visa, but we get, I get through it. Uh, eventually, I, yeah, I graduated as a, uh, what you call this? The pastry, hotel yeah. patisserie, <laughs> chef patisserie, <laughs> yeah, something like that. Uh, yeah. And then, yeah, unfortunately, after my my after I graduated, I did not take that path. Uh, I take the other path, which is, uh, yeah, uh, my work experience as a uh, plastic welding or plastic welder. So, yeah, and now it is my I'm doing my own business yeah. so uh, in God's grace yeah he allows allow this to happen to us and we are now you know um, uh, a having a good good faith to <laughs> to our to our father almighty yeah. that's awesome so, Nelson so obviously you've, you've come through some bit of a hardship as well and um, Obviously, for you, you've always had that faith in God, and 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 God really came through for you. And now you've obviously started your own business and things, and um, and haven't looked back. Yes. Um, so so that that's really really cool. And, and obviously now I see you you're hiking with your your lovely wife, which is yes. fantastic. And and how is is that really helped you as a couple? Do you think and in, in your own relationship and going forward and and spending time together? Well. Um well, it makes us really bond bond together because uh, this is our our you know moment to each other after a long after a week of um, uh, working. So yeah, we, we take our time to have a, a, a leisure uh, for a week. Uh, I mean, one day in a week. So yeah. 
that, that's really cool. That's re really awesome. And obviously going to your wife, Francis. <laughs> hey, Francis. <Hello. laughs> and, and obviously uh, for yourself, especially being a woman as well, having your husband here beside you doing something re really helps, doesn't it? Yes, definitely. Um, I wouldn't be able to do this on my own. Um, it excites us, so I do the booking for where to do the walk. Um, and as we get to the date of the walk, um, it, so the bonding doesn't only happen here, but also the planning part of it. So leading up to the day, um, it keeps us close together. And then, like what I told you earlier, sometimes we don't even talk while we're walking because we're catching our breath, but that's okay. <laughs> as long, you know, it gives us, it's quite bliss when you know that the person that you trust the most is just right next to you and you know that they're just there for you yeah and you're not doing it on your own hey man that, that's really cool and tell me a bit about your story as well and um obviously you've different background mm. <laughs> to your husband and um yeah, different. So, so what made you come to new zealand as well and um how have you found living here maybe going through some pressure and some stress and, and what sort of faith did you have into where you are now um, I'm actually the one who pushed to move overseas because I know it's best for the kids um, and we followed Nelson even if the we weren't sure whether we were gonna stay here or not because of visa obviously but I told him look I'd rather that we stay together than be apart and kids not knowing you um, it was really tough because I was a full-time I'm I still am a full-time employee and a full-time mom and a full-time wife and um, add to that we do have a special child um, that we have to deal with and we mm. don't have any family members here we don't have immediate family members so we had to go through it together um, we had really tough times our faith were actually especially me my faith was tested to a point where I turned around one day and um, Nelson guided me for probably a year and um, mm. he did not let go and just you know did not push me but he just held my hand to yeah. you know just go back to you know to our dear Lord so we did have tough times but we are in a very good place at the moment and we are actively seeking for people who can support that support us in that journey because mm. I know or we know that we cannot do it alone or we cannot do it together for so sure. we are exposing ourselves to people who can um, motivate us inspire us and hopefully through that journey along the way <laughs> we can touch others lives as well yep I mean for me what, what I've seen um, from you guys you guys are an amazing couple to be honest and and just just how you guys are working together within the hikes as well um, you know you, you you're having that moment together which is obviously very very important especially when you're going through a lot um, obviously you said you had a got a special needs child as well I mean that in itself you know it's it's really hard to go through anyway um, and obviously just having you guys um, together you know in, in those special moments and special bonding time really really helps you with your own faith as well um, and obviously having faith in God as well which is um, obviously what we what is best for all of us I guess um, but you know, just really reaching out in faith, I suppose, and, and action as best as you can. Um, so you guys are really, really incredible. I think um, you guys are yeah. very, very inspirational. And um, so, especially with these guys here. So if, if you want to come along and um, yeah. come hiking with us, Walking of Faith Adventures, yes. you get to meet this awesome couple here as, as well. And I'm sure they can inspire you. Um, and, and just a final word from you guys. Um, what's the message for other people in the same boat as you and how, what, what do you think hiking could be like for them? I personally, I thought it was just going to be as simple as, you know, being out there and enjoying the nature. But um, I do have, and I haven't told him that, but <laughs> this, but um, I feel connected to God when I'm walking because I just have a better appreciation of what he does and what he can and who he is. So, yeah, it gives, keeps that connection between me and him. So, uh, yeah, hiking is like uh, rejuvenating your, yourself, um, you know, uh, bringing back your your inner peace, something like that. Yes. After a uh, hectic, um, maybe schedule uh, week that you had. So, yeah, it's time for us to, you know, yeah, have a short walk 
and enjoy the, the environment mm -hmm. or nature. <laughs> you say sure, work. It's, it's been yeah, <laughs> it's been close to four hours it's, so far. It's, it's, uh -huh. not, it's not a day yet, so <laughs> <laughs> it's just five hours walk. We'll be right. Yeah, so it's, it's good. You'll for be your, right. Yeah, <laughs> you'll be it's right. good for your soul. It's good for your body. It's mm. good for your brain. So yes, you will run out of breath but it's short time, you will recover. Mm. Um, the benefits are amazing. Um, and again, you get to know people you know, like Dan. So thankful that you came today. Uh, it's um, my pleasure, honestly. <laughs> it's brilliant. We weren't expecting it, but mm. the unexpected is usually great. So thank you and thanks for the tips yeah, and thanks, tricks. Dan. Uh, it would have taken us six hours to come <laughs> 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 with us, you know, because you really, you know, you weren't pushing, but you were very encouraging throughout the way, which was awesome. Um, and I think I kind of pushed myself a little bit and realized, oh, I can do, I can do a little bit more. So next time we do the next walk, we'll yeah. probably be a lot better. Mm. There we yeah. go. And that's, that's what walking on faith was about, eh? Stepping out yes. of your comfort zone and yes. uh, yeah. having a bit of faith to achieve something extraordinary, which you guys are definitely doing today. Yeah. So, no, as I said, you guys are amazing. So, um, it's my pleasure to come on these hikes. You guys are family, whānau. Um, so, and obviously, you're part of the big whānau that we have. Um, so, yeah, you guys are awesome. So, thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you so much. We'll see you Cheers. guys next time. <laughs>